I'm going to show you how to tie my bottom bait rig, which has just been so effective for me over the years. Got a lot of fish on it, and I'm going to share it with you. This is the way I tie it. First of all, you need some coated, some coated hook link material. Reel off about, about a foot and a bit. And then you need, next stage is to strip back about six inches. Tie a loop in the end, small loop, this is how you're gonna hold your, hold your hook bait on. And trim that down. That's what we're left with. Strip back a bit of section of the coated material and a little loop in the end. Take straight out of the bag a bottom bait. Thread him on, like so, and also, I always like to add a little fleck of colour. So this has been soaking in a combination of tannin and the System X Attractor patch. It's been in there for months and months and months. So whatever colour you want to use to add that bit of buoyancy, I like white, you can, you know, any. Any colour really, any colour that you like, pink, green, yellow, whatever takes your fancy, whatever you feel confidence with. Stick that one on, there like that. Little bait stop on there also, get him in there, pull it tight down. And that's your first stage completed. Now I always put on milk bait first so I can tie up milk, the length of the hair, so much more easier. Okay. Next thing you want is a real is a is a is a mini ring. Now thread that on. Smallest ring you get. Thread him on like that, all the way down. Just tie a simple overhand knot. And tease down. Tease it down because what you want to do, tease it down like that. So that tiny little ring there, that's to hold the hair coming off the bend of the hook. It's not so it's a blowback rig, it's, it's there for one purpose only, and that's to hold the hair in a certain position, which gives it much better rig mechanics. White gate hook with an interned point. Now the reason I use an interned point is because if you imagine that bottom bait on the bottom of the lake, got a straight point, it's, it can blunt the end of the hook. The turned in point, it's not going to blunt as easy. So it's just about percentages. We stick, stick him on, yeah. So he's at the back end of the bend, where the bend starts from the length of the hook. Thread that through the eye. Try not the snot. Not the snot, but five or six turns. Back through the eye. And there we go. Now, next thing to do is I want to stick on a little bit of shrink tube just to act as a tiny little kicker and protect the end of the line there, the end of the uh, hook link. Small piece, shrink tube, stick it down onto there, and this will protect the end. We tie a loop, nice loop there. Put him down. There we go. Now all we need to do now, all we need to do now is to use the kettle and shrink that down. My bottom bait rig, tie it up, give it a go. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please like, 
please like and share comment you know give me some ideas for what you want me to cover and i really hope you enjoy these these vlogs that i do and these instructional videos on how i go about my fishing so until next time see you then